All right, on this episode of Building the X-Set, it's time to install the steering rack. So I have the uh, stock uh, Miata steering rack here. I went ahead and disassembled the entire thing and uh, cleaned up some of the electronics and then uh, sanded down and painted uh, the actual steering rack uh, as it was pretty rusty. A lot of Miata racks I've seen have quite a bit of rust on them. So next step basically is taking this over and getting it inside the car first portion here is basically you need to remove the uh, there's no bolt that should be on this but there is a bolt that attaches here and then one here on the uh, brake gas pedal assembly that is where your uh, steering uh, shaft will mount to as you can see here and here are those two locations that will uh, bolt onto that so first thing is remove those nuts and uh, then get the sh steering shaft into position I have the uh column here mounted and I was incorrect. This is the right mounting hole here. It's a stud off of the uh, brake and gas pedal bracket that you slip on. However, the other nut is right down there, or other stud, and you need to put a nut on that. So, um, yeah, I was a little off in the ones that you need to loosen. You do not need to remove this one. It is one under the brake pedal. Now, that I have it loosely fit, I did not have to extend my uh, steering column at all. Some people will take some vice grips here and clamp it on and beat it with a hammer to extend the shaft out to, to hit here, but um, I did not have to do that. I was uh, able to um, get the fitment without um, having to modify that. One thing, and this is a common complaint, right here, you can see it is touching the firewall. Now that is very common. You want this steering shaft to be as far left as possible because um, of clearance with uh, headers. Uh, there's not a good uh, clearance here. So um, a lot of guys have to end up bashing theirs in or something like that to get this to have clearance for the steering column because when the motor torques and moves on the, on the rubber mounts, it will um, shift over and make contact. So you want it as far left as possible. However, you don't want it hitting. So what I'm going to do, instead of cutting into the firewall, is I'm actually gonna take these brackets off and bend them. So basically this part here uh, shifts over about a quarter inch to there. And hopefully that will solve my problem. Other thing up here, this is the X motive bracket to adapt, adapt um, basically um, from this bracket that's welded on to your uh, steering column here mounts. Uh, I just have this loosely fitted with some Harbor Freight uh, bolts and nuts that I laid around, but um, I'm going to be using 5 sixteenths, uh, I think 18 pitch nuts and bolts. You will need to get um, two one and a quarter inch bolts, flange bolts, flange nuts, and then two three quarter inch flange bolts and then flange nuts uh, to mount this correctly. This is not included in the kit. I have no idea why um, they wouldn't put those in with the kit. That doesn't make sense since obviously you're going to be bolting it on, but those are not included in your hardware kit um, from X Motive. Okay, so I bent these two tabs here and here a little bit. And as you can see down there, that moved over the steering column a fair bit. Head back over to this side. If I'm getting it in the camera there, but there's a decent amount of clearance, enough uh, at least about a 3 16 quarter inch all around. So that should be plenty of clearance there. Then I uh, also got my plate mounted with my uh, 5 16 bolts. Um, this isn't necessarily the final mounting position. I'm going to wait until I have the steering wheel mounted and the seat mounted to see exactly where I like it and then adjust it from there. But uh, for the time being, that's uh, mounted and everything is very solid. So uh, that's it for this video. Next video, I'm going to be moving on to installing the NRG... Um, hub adapter quick release um, for the steering system. Thanks for watching guys. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. Please like or subscribe. See you next time.